Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, we are going to create algorithm that will check if the number is abundant or not. And also, sometimes they call it abundant number or excessive number as well. So, what is the description of this one? The sum of the factors except number itself is greater than the number. So, let's put in theory, let's say we have a 12. And let's first get the factors. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 6. Because we will not, uh, 12 also is the factors, but except number itself. Now we'll just sum of, we'll sum of this number. This is 10, 13, 15, 16. 16 is greater than 12, then it is abundant number. So let's create an uh, algorithm for this one. We'll say uh, console write and then we we'll say enter a number which is abundant number or not and here I will say var number and then I will convert to, in to integer and I will say console read line this is we'll just uh, input our number then we'll convert into int then I will create a for loop and it will start from 1 because we say it from 1 and then we can say like uh, uh, because we'll not include our number and since if it comes to the half of number it after that will not have factors anymore it is like this for example this 12 yeah uh, if we want to get the factors is 1, 2, uh, this, because this is proper uh, divisors, and 4, and 6. And after that, 7, 8, 9, 10, until 11, except the 12. It, which number you use, it, it, it will not be a uh, factor, because uh, it is not proper uh, divisor. So that's why here I will do like this until half of it. I will say number and divide by 2. Sorry. 2. So we don't want to do half per half. It will just go and it's just not good for performance because we know that after the 6 uh, there is there are no any factors uh, except the 12 because 12 uh, if it, uh, it says except number itself so here and also i will declare an integer variable it called a total i will set it to zero and i will say if the number sorry number modulus i equals zero then it is factors then i will say total I will set it, add it to total i plus i. And then in the end, we will put a if condition and say if total is greater than our number, if it is, then this is a bounded number. Then we will say, uh, we will say, a number is an abundant number. If as, we we'll just copy this one and paste here, we we'll say is not an abundant number. And let's run it. First, let's uh, enter an abundant number. 12, 12 is a bundled number. Let's write another one. 
is 13. 13 is not a bouncing number. And also we have here a list of abundant numbers. As you see that we can try one a big number maybe here. Let's do for 252. Here's a bounded number, like 253 is not, is not a bounded number. This is like that. But I just want to make a kind of, uh, at least it will start from, uh, for example, from 1 and not from 1, because the smallest abundant number is 12, we know. We start from 12 until a large number. How we can uh, do that? First, let me remove these things. And then, here we, we declare a 4. And number will start 12. Until, let's say, 1 million. Let's count the zeros. Yes, 1 million. And let's create another four, and then it will start um, from one, and we say until our numbers. Mm, we say I until half of it, yeah, like this. And then we say if, let's comment this one, and let's put first here is end total, I will set it, maybe I will here, end total, I set it zero, and I will set if, I, modulus j is equal to zero this is then it is it is uh, factors so then we say total equal total plus j and after this one here i will put my if condition i will say if total is greater than i, then we will say we will say i is an abundant number. We'll not write when if it is not. We'll not write it. And also, I want to uh, declare another variable. It's called counter. We want to count from 12 until 1 million how many abundant number or excessive numbers we have it. I will say in counter, I will set it zero. And if we have a right condition, I will just increase my counter. And in the end of my array, I will say console right line. Then I will say there are let's see I forget this are counter abundant numbers from twelve until one million. And let's run it, how it is functioning. First I want to get until like maybe uh, thousand. Uh, we'll check it if it is uh, working properly or not. Mm, let me see, I hope it is working properly. And let's compare. 12, 18, 20, 24, 30, 
we have the fire is good and from 200 we have yeah, 204, 8, 10, yeah, 270 it's probably it's working it's uh, properly it's working sorry and let's run it until 1 million how many abundance number we have it here I will say put another zero this is three and this is three one million yeah. let's run it and see the results Now we are almost finished. Let's see, yeah. Uh, and there is almost quarter a uh, million uh, abundant number from 12 until 1 million. That's it, guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed. Please, if you like, subscribe my channel. See you next video. Bye.